Some people tries to understand why something bad happens to them, something that causes them suffering. They tries to find explanations to explain why something bad happens to them and the explanations they found depend on their level of their culture. Many tries to find answers in religion and one of the most frequent explanations found, which offers the consolation the sufferer needs, is that this is how God wanted it. Well, in most cases suffering is the consequence of actions for which human is responsible. Suffering is the consequence of decisions that were made at a certain time, and that were made wrongly. But because God is responsible for the suffering of many people I know, and because I also believe in God, I decided to focus on this topic. Even if I believe that there is a force in the universe that many consider to be God, I also believe in other philosophies. And regarding God, I don't think that people interprets God correctly. From my point of view, God made and makes mistakes. For many, God is the cause of suffering. From a religious and spiritual point of view, I agree with this statement. I think that suffering is the payment for our mistakes. And for the following question addressed to God, why God do I suffer so much? God does not offer any answer, but if he did answer, he would say, because you deserve it. Because we can't be objective since it's about us, we can't understand where and what we did wrong or to whom, but the universe knows. And the universe punishes and revenge himself. In some cultures there is belief in a spiritual world, belief in evil spirits, spirits that are evil and do not know. That do harm in an unconscious way to other spirits that suffer. And of course the universe finds ways to establish a balance, otherwise there would be chaos. Well, you would say that I'm wrong. It's your right to say what you want, but there are energies around some people that can be felt, negative energies. How many times have you sat next to a person and had the feeling that that person doesn't like you, without doing anything to her, or that someone envies you? There would be many aspects that can be discussed here but that would mean deviating from the topic. Until next time, stay safe, and don't forget to smile.